long, long ago, two grey gods crawled through a rift into this world and found it warm, lush, and unclaimed. It lacked only worshippers, so these gods, the Famhair, gifted apes with thought, shaping them into a clever, violent race, humanity. Great civilizations soon spread across the world, bloodthirsty, cruel, and strong in magic. Then the Famair turned their greedy eyes on Arborea and Canestia, the homes of the elves and dwarfs, who until then had hardly noticed the thinking apes or their gods. Thus began the All War. As the elves and dwarves banded together to defeat the Famair and their human armies. But the Famair were unkillable. All that could be done was drive them back through the rift. And even this cost the old races. All their gods and heroes died closing it. Worse, the farm here never stopped clawing at it from the void, rending the very fabric of the world. So, a song spell was made that would forever knit up the rift. And as punishment for their part in the war, a human king's daughter was enchanted so she might sing the song without food or rest for eternity. A thousand years on, and the maiden is forgotten, but the whispers of the famhair still invade the dreams of the ambitious, promising power and crimson glory. Three times have evil men heeded that siren call and sought the rift. And three times have they been defeated by ragtag and unproven heroes. Today, the whispers wake a new evil, more devious than those that came before. Who this time will stand against it? What heroes this time will rise? Welcome everyone to Bard's Tale 4, the beta. So set the Wayback Machine to June of 2015. And I'm following another game in um, uh, Kickstarter and they send out a message that says some friends of theirs, from friends of theirs are, are going to make the Bard's Tale uh, 4 and uh, they need some help on Kickstarter. So, uh, yeah, so I, I put some money towards it and uh, kind of forgot about it. I got some updates in the email from time to time. And the beta started. I got an email that said, here's your, here's your beta key. So I figured I'd give it a play. Um, the picture came back. Remember, it's beta. Uh, enter a game for your new uh, LP. Let's play. Sure. Confirm. The song I sing will tell the tale of a cold and wintry day, of castle walls and torch-lit halls, and a price men had to pay. When evil fled and brave men bled, the dark one came to stay, till men of old for blood and gold had rescued the scarab. Yeah, um, what I noticed so far is that, uh, at least in the very beginning, humor is kind of lacking. And I was a little like, well, I'm playing what looks like it's going to be a good 
role-playing game, but is it the Bard's Tale? But uh, Scarabray has been uh, kind of uh, ruined, so, you know, not all endings are going to be good. Uh, and that's kind of a cool uh, little waiting star symbol there in the lower right-hand corner as we wait for it to load. Speak to who? Who am I speaking to? I'm up. Hanging's too good for him. Bannon's too good for him. Uh, can we talk to anybody up here? Hello. Kind of a head bob going on here. Anyway, I I don't play RPGs a lot anymore. Uh, I'm not sure. I don't play RPGs a lot anymore. Um, I did in 2015, but I started this channel in 2017. Um, back when I thought it might be a good idea to watch people, uh, or to have people watch uh, as I play games and make a fool out of myself. But, um, I don't know. It's interesting. I figured I'd back off. Hey, who are you talking to? Um, I figure I'd give it a try here and see what it's like. So this is obviously the guy I need to talk to. Yes, I have played about ten minutes of the introduction. I don't... The movement's kind of weird. Can I stop the head bobbing? Um, I got it in ultra, ultra, ultra mode. Motion blur? No. God rays? Sure, why not? Depth of field, ambient occlusion. No motion, motion blur. Is there a head bob or something? Gameplay. Uh, confirm. Uh, show tutorials. Head bob. No head bob. Never like the head bob. Okay. Head bob's off. Excellent. I like it a lot better already. Uh, so, right, I'm, I'm just seeing if there, is there anything we can pick up? Anything? Anything at all? Nope, apparently not. Hello. Alright, shift run. Yes, I can hold down shift and kind of jog. I jogged for a little bit. Hi, how you doing? All right, uh, let's talk to this guy. Oh. oh, that's a bad business, and no mistake. I, I don't understand. What did they do? What was their crime? Their crime? Existing was their crime. The Fatherites don't like our kind. Come on, before those paladins give us a second glance. I'll give them a second glance. And maybe a... Oh, here now. Save it. You'll only get yourself killed. And we need you. You're gonna save Scarabray. <laughs> ah, you're looking at me like you think old Robbie's had a few too many. Well, maybe I have. But this is no drunkard's fancy. You've been in my dreams seven nights now, and each one with the same end. You the hero, and me lost. They all start with some evil slithering out of the darkness, and you driving it back from whence it came. But I don't make it to the happy ever after. And there's a moment right at the end where you could save me, and instead you choose not to. You just turn away and leave me to be buried alive. Well, maybe that means I shouldn't trust you. But you're the best hope we've got. So I guess I'll just have to pray that part's not true. Anyway, hero, let's get back to the Adventurer's Guild. I have a few words to say to the congregation. This way. Your party, one of three. Rabbi, the leader of the Adventurer's Guild, has temporarily joined your party. While in combat, Rabbi can attack with his axe and shalehi. Shale, shalag? Shala? Shilia? I don't know how to pronounce that word. As well as hand out health potions to his allies. Uh, do I want to disable the tutorial? Nah, we'll keep going. 
This is Melody the Bard. She's your very first adventurer. You'll be able to replace her with a custom character shortly, if you like. She can attack with a hatchet, gain powers by drinking booze, and play Sanctuary Score to shield her allies. You can bring up the party bar at any time by right-clicking. Right-click. How about that? Um, escape. No. Uh, alright, so I brought up the party, party bar. What the heck is this? Abilities. Alright, I want to turn off the party bar. Here. All right, I want to turn off the party bar, so right click to turn it on and off. Groovy. Anything in there? Nope. Let's go down the steps. You can't swing a cat in Scarabray these days without hitting a paladin. Not that I'm prone to swinging cats. Mm, food. Finest chops and follies. Guaranteed not to be cut. Water from the lake from which the blessed lady rose wards off elves, terrorized dwarves. Protect yourself from monsters with a sword. Mushrooms. An assortment of edible mushrooms. This item can be eaten or used in crafting. What a load of shit. There's a few who will take advantage of hard times. Yeah, I already, I already lose it all. Okay. Uh, can I steal a sword? Like that one? Steel? You wanna sell it to me? Alright, no doors. So apparently if you can do something with it, it's gonna light up in blue. <laughs> Alright, any of these barrels? Uh, where was I? I'm lost. We came down the steps, came over here, nothing going on over here, nothing going on over here. See, this is how I play RPG games. I gotta try to this find is where everything. I set up. I don't care. You're blocking the public way. You'll have to move. Well, where am I supposed to go? Uh, yeah. Okay, let's get in here. So you can see on the map, is M for map? Yeah, okay, so I'm supposed to go up here, but currently I'm headed this way. I'm fine with heading this way. Any more barrels I can bust into? More murder. I should... There's nothing to begin fighting the Fatherites head on. There's another way. At least, I hope there is. And the so-called... Here we go. What do we get? Wood? I don't know what we're going to need wood for, but we'll take it. So there's... Oh. Gold skeet. Gold coins. Nice. Open chest. Ta-da! I get... Requires training in Archmage robes. Boots. Who can wear boots? Can you wear boots? How about I for inventory? How about that? Can you wear these boots? This window contains both the inventory and the character sheets for your entire party. From here you can view your adventurer's attributes and passives, equip gear, drink potions, eat food, and manage your inventory. Uh, I'm all... You have multiple inventory pages which to store items. You can flip between the pages. Good, 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 good. Okay, on the left is a character sheet for your currently selected adventure. Here you can see their attributes, passive abilities, currently equipped gear, and mastered abilities. Confirm. Four of six. Mastered abilities are abilities that have been permanently committed to memory by the adventurer. You gain mastered abilities primarily through your skill tree. You can also master certain abilities found on items by repeatedly using that ability in combat. You can select which mastered ability you have active by opening the mastery book. You can change which adventurer you're viewing by selecting their portrait at the bottom of the screen. Yep. One more. T one more. Lastly, you can switch over to the crafting menu by clicking on the crafting button here. Brew potions, build tools, and cook food in the crafting window. Learn new crafting recipes by buying them from merchants and learning them through your adventurer's skill trees. We got any crafting? Uh, fiber, required ingredients, wood. So I can actually make fiber if I want to. I don't want to. So we're looking at Rabby. Can he wear the boots? No. Um, 
All right, so we're just gonna we're gonna we're gonna get out of here. How do I get out of here? X, the little X at the corner. Right, we got the chest. Anything else around here? Only the temple has the answers. Is this a good guy or is this a paladin guy? How you doing? Right, uh, anything else? Anything else? Attach rope. Grappling hook required. I don't have a grappling hook. But hey, if we ever need to go down, this is where we go down. All right. I don't know if it's showing up in the video or not, but I'm getting getting some screen tearing even though V-Sync is on. I'm just gonna ignore it. What do we got? Ooh, cabbage and rotted food. Let's just take the cabbage and not the rotted food. I'm going to assume we don't need rotted food for anything. God, these guys are annoying. Oh, can I walk up these stairs? What's this note? Read Father Right Notice. Be it known that the Temple of the Sword Father has named the former residents of this house witches and heretics, and all their goods are now temple property. Their debts, however, were their own, and will not be paid by the temple or its servants. Typical. Alright, I can't get in there, I can't get in there. Uh, anything else? Got a weak stomach? You better get used to it. All a scarab rail burn before these priests are All right, I don't want to miss any barrels. Hot soup! Delicious soup! Really? Best soup! Aha! Come here for soup, have you? Well, soup is not an adequate description for what you'll be getting. You'll be getting fulfillment, joy, the tender embrace of your mother's arms. This is not just soup. It is a revelation, a liquid epiphany. Heaven by the spoonful. There is no question that this soup is good enough for you. The question you have to ask yourself is, am I good enough for this soup? Hmm. Uh... No. On consideration, you are not good enough for this soup. I see. Ruffians. I see. All right then, pal. I'm not good enough for your soup. All right, continue. So this is like a waypoint. Uh, new step. So if we look on the map, uh, where where are we supposed to be going? Way up here. Got it. Arms for your bloody arms. Um. Hey, pal. Sorry, I can't talk to you. The game's not letting me. It's not my fault. Uh, did I see something back here? Collect herb. Sure, collect herb. Uh huh. Can't open the door. Round him up. That's what I see. I've known elves, dwarves, and trout all my life. We could listen to what they had to say, but really, are we interested? I'm not interested. Uh, all right, come on, nothing. Nothing. Must yep, step complete. The temple New knows step. What it's doing. Right, new step is this way. I, c I could take these shields. What are you going to do? Oh, here's another note. Let's read it. Uh, be it known that the Temple of the Sword Father seeks adventure Naf Oakmore for questioning connection with necromancy and possession of forbidden texts. Anyone with information on his whereabouts is instructed to report to the temple immediately. Borator of Bishop Henred. Uh, yeah, whatever. Barrels? What's up here? Yep, nope, just decorations. And Here we are. The guild. Not ready to go in yet. Okay. I'm looking around. Oh, I thought sure that was a chest. Anything? Anything? Nope. Just a place to get stuck. 
No more herbs. There's the entrance. There's the docks. Uh huh. Can't talk to you. All right, let's go in. Rabbi. Hey, Rab. We are pleased you're safe. Aye, me too. Bide here a bit. I'm going to say a few words. There were more folk killed last night. Some great beast, they said. And again, they blame us for it. Something's brewing, that's for certain. I've heard the singing three times this month. Three times! But what is behind it? Who is behind it? All right, quiet down, friends. I've something to say. What I just saw at Henry's hanging tree was the last straw. We can't just keep talking about doing something. We have to... Did you hear that? The song of the maiden. What does it foretell this time? Arrest the heretics! Burn this den of evil to the ground! This way, hero! Hurry! All right, character creation. How about that? Would you like to create a custom character? Yep. No offense, Melody, but... Uh... You're not the character I want to go into the game with. <laughs> Alright, so we want to be a bard. Practitioner. I mean, we're going to be a bard, okay? You done yet? Alright, fighter. Rogue? <laughs> Bard. Uh, let's see, can I do anything here? Culture. Archetyped Bard. And I don't think I can do anything here. This is just telling me what the stats are. Culture. Um, Outlander human. Fide. Inyar. I guess we'll be just the first one. The culture determines the aspect of your appearance, as well as starting culture passive. A trow. No. Elf. No. Dwarf. Interesting face for a dwarf. Outlander. Kind of skinny. Um, Bade. I don't know. The, occupying the lowland of the south. Descending raiding peoples. Live in the forests. We'll just be the first one because I have no idea. All right, customize. Or I'll hurt you. One home, you niblet. Your mother's calling. You have no honor. Come on, fight. Were you born this annoying or did you study? It would be so nice if you weren't here. You don't scare me. All right, innocent male. You don't scare me. You're gonna get- You have no- I shall cleanse you from this earth! It hurts me just to- You make me sick! Come on! Why are you even trying? Why are you- Run along now, or I shall have to spank you. Is that your face? Is that your face? Or are you walking backwards? <laughs> You've got- This isn't my first fight, you know. Innocent male's fine. Character name. Uh, Tolacram. And uh, skills. Skill points three. Welcome to your skill tree. Each time you level up, you earn a skill point, which can be spent to unlock any skill. 
click here to swap between the different skill trees of your adventure's archetype. Example, attack, defense, unity, utility. Your skill tree is broken into three tiers. To unlock the second tier of skills, you must spend eight skill points. To unlock the third tier, you must spend an additional 16 points. Blah, 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 blah. At any time, you can refund individual skills by right-clicking on them. You can also reset your entire skill tree by pressing the Refund Skill Points button. Ooh. That's nice. Hot Cross Buns. Every bard's first instrument is the simple but portable musical bones. This skill is learned automatically and cannot be unlearned. Alright. Spell Points plus one. Rabble Rouser Novus. Troubadour Novus. If you refund, you will no longer have enough skill points to spend spent to access tier 1 skills. Are you sure you want to refund? What did I do? What did I do? Skill points 2. Refund. Sure. I'm back up to 3. Alright. Attack. I want to attack. Strength plus 1. Swordman's... Swordsman. Novus. Deal one physical to first enemy in range. Hits two times. Axeman's Novus. Basic combat. Do I have to train in this? Training in booze. Already trained in that. Okay. Uh, head knocker. Critical hit swords. Critical hit axes. Bludgeons. Strength. 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 Alright, I'm gonna go for strength. And I'm going to go for Swordsman, Novus, and uh, what else? Axeman, Bludgeoned, Critical Hit Swords, Critical Hit Axes. I'm going to do Critical Hit Swords. So we're going to have to get a sword, obviously. Uh, finalize. Because I don't have points right. So I'm going all attack. Alright, and obviously I'm holding an axe, not a sword. Uh, there's my abilities. Crafting recipe, alcohol. Uh, critical hit swords, skill points at level 3, 10, and 18. Bade, bade adventurers gain a bonus skill point at level 3, 10, and 18. Swords ability, storm of blades, passing slash, thundering smash, sweeping slash, all or nothing, last breath. Have 20% chance to reset their cooldown. Uh, gain one spell point and one stack of drunk. Max drunk stacks three. <laughs> Finalize. Finish. I have no idea what I'm doing. Can I change weapons? I can't. I'm gonna have to find a sword, so finish. Yep. So there I am. I kind of look like Bill Nye the Science Guy there. But uh doesn't look like I have much of a choice with the face, at least in the beta. Alright. Find the Adventurers Guild. Scarabray below. You have a character that can use spell points. While in combat, magic spells and bardic song cost spell points to activate instead of opportunity points. Spell points can be generated in combat by using abilities like chug or meditate. Practitioners also passively generate spell points each turn. Spells are easy to spot because of the spell gems on their ability icon. I guess that's this. Apparently I'm by myself. No. Oh, we made it. What a nightmare, eh? Come on. We've got to get to the old guild and figure a way to protect ourselves. Yep, I'm looking for stuff though. Anything, anything at all. Don't like spider webs. All right, so we climbed down from up there. Interesting. There's no jumping in the game, at least not yet. J for jump? No. Can't say I'm a big fan of games without jump, but, um, yeah. I'm going to assume that I'm not going to find anything in here.
The Adventurer's Guild from back before the old town was buried is still here after all these years. Just a little filthier and liable to collapse. At least it's well hidden. No danger of another visit from the Fatherlands. Famous last words. We're looking for a green door. All right. I'm looking for loot. Look at the crazy green lights. There's something over there. There's a note. Do not enter, but over to the temple. This property is condemned. Disease, corruption, or abom abominations may be found within. Do not enter. Can I enter? Can I enter? Guess not. Alright, I think this is a save point. Hold on, hero. You'd better touch that luck stone. Luck stones have been around since before the All War. And it's always good to give them a rub, particularly before a fight. They can give you a second chance if things go wrong. There. Now you're safe. No matter what befalls, you'll come right back to here. Uh, so I can load game anytime, but I can't save game anytime. Uh, please make a note of my annoyance with that. Um, I'm on a PC. I'm not on a console. I should be able to save any time I want. Uh, what's this? Blue Highway. This is not the way I'm supposed to go, but we can collect herbs. I don't know what we're going to use them for, but we can collect them. Oh, there's more over there. Back over here. Can I get to them? Yeah. You never know. Aha. Grain. Anything over here? Nope. All right. There's where we uh, rubbed the save stone. And I was just over here, right? I can push this out of the way. It seems like it wants me to go this way. So I'll go this way. Maybe come back. Where am I anyway? So I'm here, and where was that door? Over here somewhere? We'll take a look. Yeah, I think it was just over here. I don't know, is this the way I'm supposed to go? Because this is a dead end, yep. Hmm. Are they adventurers? Did they escape the fire? By the moment. Don't think these are any friends of ours. No, they're up to mischief. We'll have to fight them, I fear. All right, well, you know what? Um, we are now at uh, 35 minutes. So I'm going to go back and uh, rub the save game stone. And uh, when we come back, uh, we'll continue on with the uh, beta of Bard's Tale 4. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later.